Hurley. Uh, Mr. Mike Hurley's with us. Mike, Please lovely to, to see you. you. Lovely hey, to Mike. meet you. Hey, I'm so excited because you're the inventor of this product, which is really special. Tell me more, Mike. Is, is, this, is this your thing? Are you a gardener professionally? No, I'm not a professional gardener. Um, I'm, I'm more of an engineer, actually. Uh -huh. So I'm actually in IT most of the time. Okay. But, uh, but this, is, uh, this is our product. Um, it, was, uh, it was invented uh, about, uh, about four or five years ago, actually. Yeah. And, uh, and we've, uh, we've made it, uh, make, make it in the UK. Mm -hmm. uh, it was a labour of love. Uh, four of us got together. We oh, thought uh, there's got to be a way that we can, uh, we can get this to work. And, uh, and here we are Mike, on QVC. This is really special because it's a vertical planter. I'll give the details. I was just about to there, Rich. 565 uh, 275. Over to you, Jules. Thank you. £20 a QVC prize. <laughs> For two of them. <laughs> For That's two really indeed. important. Now, yeah. it is new today on QVC. They are flower towers. They make a boring column look fantastic. A wall, a fence. A wall. Well, any, yeah, any, any yeah. pillar, yeah. in fact. Yeah. Next yeah. to the door, absolutely. So let me tell me, what was that eureka moment? You were sitting there, you were watching gardening, or you were doing some gardening at home. Well, what was I the think, eureka moment? I think, like, uh, like most people, the eureka moment was, uh, well, why, why, are these, uh, why are these plants not coming on evenly through, yes. through, the, uh, through what we'd got at the time? We thought, well, what can we do? So the key was even distribution of, uh, of water. That is the crucial thing. In fact, Absolutely. I was writing about this in Amateur Gardening the Good. other day, saying these wonderful vertical columns are fantastic. Watering is the most complicated thing to do. But what Mike has done with this has got this ingenious built-in watering system. Explain it to me, Mike. Yeah. And here it is. So the, the key to this is uh, a varying watering system all the way through. Now, if you look very closely, you'll see that small hole at the bottom. Small hole. Big hole at the top. Middle-sized hole in the middle. Uh, Middle-sized hole, that's right. You, you're mm -hmm. catching on and, the and that's clever. You see, because the water, you pour water in at the top. That's right. And then normally, if you had big holes there, all the water would come out there. And this is a graduated watering, so the water goes evenly through the column. It's so Now, that's not rocket it's science. Absolutely. Which says it's not, not rocket because science. at the bottom where gravity yes, as right. is greatest, yeah. that's there. where the biggest flow of water would be. There so restrict the flow of water yeah, absolutely. in the middle, when it's the that's middle, right. give it a medium size. And at the top, where it's got the least water, it's got the biggest opening, and there's your even watering. Absolutely. It's not after you've invented it, it's not brain yeah, it's rocket like, science, it's like is it? most things, isn't yeah, it? Good yeah, good for you. Absolutely. So, what it does, it gives that even distribution. So, every flower in that tower is yeah. getting the same amount of water. Can we see some of these photos? Well, can I? Because I love these. Because what you get is even growth of your plant. What you're getting is two wall mounted planters for your money. Now, look at these begonias here. Look at that, Jules. You wouldn't know it's there. And to water it, all you do is you put your hose pipe or you put your, 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 your feed at the top, and it just goes throughout the, co the column. Even the well, there we can just see the, the hole through. at the top. Yeah, so yeah. you can feed it through there. That's if you've got a hose pipe, great. If you've got a watering can, great. So there we go. That that's begonias, but also, of course, you can use it with with primulas. We have primulas on just the end, so you can use it with spring bedding. You can use it with summer bedding. You can also use it with strawberries if we've got here that's tomatoes. Sweet. There's another one there. Look at this, Jules. Look at those begonias there. Absolutely fantastic. And then I'll just show you one more photo there. Look at that. Absolutely amazing. That trail of colour is phenomenal. It's beautiful, isn't it? Could you also add feed at this very same time, Rich? Yes. If you were with the watering can, you, you could, could put your flower power in yes, there. You could. Uh, yes, you uh, could. Uh, you could do that, couldn't yeah. you? Yeah. Can we see, Mike, what's the right-hand side? Talk us through what we've got here. They look fantastic. Right, yeah, so we've got, uh, we've got some luscious strawberries here at the top there. Um, you can eat them if you like, well, but, but after growth. the show. That's Brilliant. Fantastic. Absolutely. So, uh, well, even growth all the way from bottom to yeah. top. At the bottom? We've got uh, lobelia a, a, a lobelia at yep. the bottom here, and again, you can see it's, uh, it's uh, even growth all the way through. And that's through. really important, because quite often, George, just to point, what happens normally with these things is you get a lot of uh, growth at the bottom. And then the nothing top, at the top. Yeah, I've seen. Why this even growth is so important. I love this system. It's great. Uh, this system wouldn't work horizontally, would it, because of those feed holes? No, that's correct. It'd so. have to work vertically. It, it at the would. front, though, next to maybe a, a kitchen window, what are we seeing there, Mike? Well, you've got your herb tower there. It's uh, absolutely lovely. We've got some mint, we've got some parsley in there, we've got some thyme. Look at and, that. And the fragrances that come yeah. off of it. Fantastic. Mike, can I ask you how easy it is to plant these up? Very easy. Tell Very me, easy show me. So, so once you've assembled the uh, the tower, which you, will take you a couple of minutes. Yeah, a couple of minutes. Very easy to assemble. A little bit of gravel at the bottom for drainage. You put your compost in the top, tamp it down, and you put your plug plants in on your first layer. Yes. Next layer of compost goes in. Yeah. Tamp it down, and plug you keep building in. it uh, yeah. up up in such a way. You put two in the top. And that's what gives you a nice crown of colour all the way through. But it's the even water it's, which is the most important. It's so important, Jules. And basically, you're paying for an ordering system. You're getting a sophisticated system. I love this, actually, the packaging, because it's a nice gift as well, isn't Absolutely. it? Absolutely. Yeah. Nice packaging is fine. So I presume that there's a do-it-yourself show on next, but most of the people 
we'll be able to put two little screws. As you can see, little holes at the top. Fix the wall. Two fix screws. Fix the wall Absolutely. there. Use a couple of um, uh, the raw type plugs. Yeah. Yes. And, and you're away. But George, Absolutely. you could pay twenty pounds for an ordinary climbing plant, an established climbing plant, to try and grow against a wall or against yes. a fence, and it takes time to establish. With this, you can have instant, instant colour. That's what I love about it. Transform a boring wall. Well, there we've got the our fence. tomatoes again, and you'll notice, and it's a good guide. Tomatoes at the top, tomatoes at the bottom, pretty much a similar size. And, and that's telling you about that even watering. Absolutely. And, and it's the big new thing, you know, vertical gardening it's called, one of the stars of the Hampton Court Flower Show. I'm proud to have it on QVC today. Well, there's a pair, uh, the wall-mounted plant and flower uh, receptacle with that watering system. £20 a QVC price. My first time you've been on television, is everyone watching you this morning? Well, Anyone to say hello here. to? Uh, hello, Mum. <laughs> <laughs> to Mike's mum, of course, <laughs> and everybody else that's watching.